Happy Tip Tuesday, golfers. All right, Jake, we get this question a lot. We're out here on the lesson tee. How high do I tee up my golf ball with a driver? And while we're at it, where do you put it in your stance? Uh, so a great start point for everybody is you, the ball should be at least halfway above the crown of the driver. So I should be able to see half of the ball above the head of the driver. That encourages me to hit up on it. And if anything, a little higher is better because I want to make sure I hit up on the golf ball, which is why it's teed up in the first place. Yeah. Yeah, tee is a good thing. It helps you launch. Typically, we're looking for two to four degrees of upward motion into a golf ball so you can launch it up in the air. So we want that tee up at least half the ball above the crown. Unfortunately, we see a lot of low tees here at the golf center because a lot of players cut across the golf ball and hit down even with their driver. That's what that slice move is. And so they compensate by lowering the tee. And I say to all of those players, Let's encourage proper motion with the tee. Move it forward a little bit, get it up in the air, get that golf ball up so you can hit up on it. And that will kind of force you to move into the golf ball properly. What about ball position, Jake? Well, with that same idea, because we're trying to hit up on it, we want to put the golf ball more forward in our stance. So the start point I want to have is at my lead heel. So you can see here when I set up to the golf ball, my foot's slightly flared open and I want that golf ball lined up with the front heel. That puts it forward in my stance so I can hit more up on the ball. Yeah, so we're hitting a little down on those irons, about three degrees. We flatline out with the hybrid in the fairway. The driver's a little more forward. We do use that front heel. Now, it also depends on swing shape, though. So people don't have to be scared if they have a little more lateral move and leg, maybe a little forward of that. Absolutely. If they're a little more rotational, maybe a little bit back. You have to find the right spot for you, but it's definitely forward. Yeah, if you understand your golf swing and your release of the driver, it's one of those things that we can use the tee height and position to fine tune your launch. But it's important that you do it because you understand it. If we go back to what you said earlier about people tending to tee it too low because they hit it a little better when they hit down on it, we have to be careful if that's just then what we do because it's always going to encourage us- Never change. To make the wrong move. Yeah. So especially when you practice, trend to tee it higher than you think you're normally even comfortable with to encourage the right swing and have you move in that direction. Yeah, I would say generally speaking a little higher and a little more forward than you think is a great idea. Next time you're practicing mess around with it but keep it forward keep it up in the air so you can swing up on it. It'll lead to better drives.